Hey guys, so I know it's been a while since we had a kind of present vlog because today is March 14th. We are still uploading videos all the way from Japan, which is like in December, early January. But I just wanted to give you guys this update. I am now um, really stressed. <laughs> We're doing something exciting again tomorrow. The reason I am very stressed is because, well, I am in my, if you guys don't know, I am in my last semester of college. So a lot of um, the stress is coming from my thesis project. And I won't go into details, but this week has been kind of hard for me. One thing being, oh, my phone cracked. So my phone cracked while I was in, I was in the shower and the touch screen doesn't work. This is like the worst time because I am gonna travel tomorrow. I have been like having to need to text people and I've been texting from my smartwatch. Thank God I have this thing to be honest because I can't make any calls. Well, I can't accept any calls. Basically, I can't do a lot of things which is really inconvenient. And that's when you realize that we are so dependent on phones. But that's another thing. I just want to document that how stressed I am because scared that I won't be able to finish this thesis project. <sighs> in a month, it it'll be over in like Two months, two months. I just wanted to let you guys know just in case I don't record anything. Got this new heavy duty bag and this is all a mess because I am packing right now. Just in case I don't record anything, at least I have this and maybe I'll like whoosh to uh, my destination. So see you guys in a later clip. Just made it to our first destination. We are in Zurich, Switzerland right now after a long eight hour flight. Local time is about hoping that those clocks, these clocks at the airport are right, but local time should be 8 a.m. Back in New York, it is 3 a.m. So this is about the time I would be sleeping. Whole eight hour flight um, from New York to here. Didn't sleep very much. Sleep schedule has been pretty bad these days. So three is like the standard time that I've been sleeping so right now I'm starting to get really sleepy but I have about an hour and 30 minutes wait until I get on my next flight for two hours to get to my final destination so guys keep guessing where I'm gonna go yeah this is the airport got nice views it's very serene flight wasn't too terrible I did have children sitting in front of me so it was a struggle for a bit but it was what it was and it seemed pretty good for an eight hour flight keep guessing i won't tell you guys until i get there maybe we'll spin to that so i just got to my airbnb and oh geez i'm sweating so much <laughs> sorry i know that has nothing to do with anything but i've been up since like 10 in the morning since new york and right now it's 4 p.m in here in Athens. Did I mention it was Athens? Well, if I didn't, here it is. I am here in my Airbnb in Athens and you're probably wondering why is there such good lighting? You guys are gonna be so, so like surprised. Small place, but it's a very luxurious place I would say. So we have like a king size bed over here. It's just me traveling. Got this situation. Kitchen's kind of like this size. Some appliances. We are on the eighth floor. Got a closet over here. Not much. Um, got the bath. Pretty neat. Bath. Okay. I'm like hiding it, but the best, you might be able to see from that window over there, but the best thing. This is a penthouse, which is pretty crazy. I'm very tired at the moment, so. Please excuse my messiness, even though I'm always like this, but look at this view. Okay, you guys don't want me in the view, but I'll show you guys what it's like. So you can see the islands down there. And check this out. And the Acropolis is right over there with the Parthenon right there. If you guys aren't amazed, then I don't know what amazes you. Oh my God, I'm having like the time of my life right now. I am so tired, but I'm glad to finally have gotten here. I don't know if I'll do much today. If not, this is just a whole bunch of like an introduction vlog to my first day here in Athens. Oh, let me explain why I'm here. <laughs> 
Um, right now it is spring break. I have a week off from school. When I first decided to buy this ticket, there's just like a seagull flying at like eye level, which is fascinating. But sorry, I got distracted very, <laughs> very easily. I kept telling this story to like so many people. When I bought this ticket, I was really like out of my head. On that day, I donated blood, so. Like, I was really, really out of it. And then when I got back from donating blood, I saw this, you know, those typical um, flight deals, like going from $60 from New York City to wherever. So there was that, and I was like, oh, let me see if I could do something for spring break. And then I was looking through the tickets, and I had this all thing set up. I think it was a trip to Athens, and I had it set up and whatnot, like the flight. But then I realized that the dates weren't blocked out for spring break and I spent hours and I just was so bummed that I ended up going to another site because I was bummed to purchase some tickets so I went and did that and I, within like uh, 30 minutes I booked the ticket to here booked my Airbnb and just went a little crazy it was very much like a spur of the moment sort of thing I have these moments where I just think if I die tomorrow at least I did this, right? Because right now, after seeing this view, oh my god, I can't believe I'm here. I always say this, but I'm so like grateful and I'm so <clears throat> blessed to just like, like who who in the world gets these kind of views? And like average college student like me, right? So I'm very fortunate for that. And the thing about this place is um, it would be like an average price of a hotel back in the United States. I rented a penthouse instead of going frugal like I did when I was in Korea because... I don't know. Because I thought, when will I ever have this opportunity? That is why. I don't know if I'll do anything today. That's why I'm like, I don't know. And maybe we'll do some more exciting stuff tomorrow. But as always, take my words with a grain of rice.